so today we're on planet Cyrene still, kicking butt there. Um, we're going to be hunting rhino beetles, of course. Want to make sure to clear off uh, anything that'll be confusing, stuff like that. Make sure we get our repaired done immediately. So that stuff's from our last hunt. We don't want to be confused on uh, what we get or don't get. You know what I mean? But I do actually want the skill gain stuff for sure. So I hope you guys are having a good day. Um, it's almost Christmas, so I also hope you enjoyed that. So we've got all our repairs done. I'm going to go ahead and uh, drop my ammo in there so we have an exact amount of ammo. Um, that way I'm not lying about what, what I said, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so there's 300 pad. I'm going to armor up, of course. We're going to be hunting the bigger rhino beetles. So this ought to be pretty good. Um, I'll show you where we are on planet Cyrene. Right here. Boom. It's a great hunting area. There's actually multiple things you can hunt here. And so uh, I like it. We're going to take um, my serpent plate off of the... Uh, Perseus, I don't need Perseus for the hunt we're about to do, is my belief um, that I can do it with the Serpent's Plate and the uh, normal, uh, what is this, pixie armor, adjusted. And so that's what we'll hope for. If I have to switch over and we have to use the uh, actual part of core armor, we will. I doubt that's the actual issue, though. Make sure that we have it. Okay. So, let uh, have to put it on, huh, right? And obviously, I need to be equipping... Um, or upgrading this it can be tiered I think all of it almost and I could be wrong we could be like 10 seconds into this and I find out hey we we technically are gonna need that we'll find out though I don't think that's gonna be the issue so I'll show you what we'll be hunting with um, of course, combat-wise, which I know I don't do much, I actually am a pyrokineticist. Hence the, the burn down, right? You know. And so, um, I think this guy's reasonably high level pyrokinetics, 35th level. And so, we'll be using pyrokinetics. Um, honestly, I like hunting with swords, too. They're freaking kick butt. I'm going to make sure we grab a loot pill. We'll see exactly what happens here. Um, honestly, I think we kill these things so slow that the loot pill is actually not going to matter. But let's pretend it does, just in case. You know what I'm saying? I I just don't want to lie to you guys. This The loot pill is likely not going to be a factor in this in any capacity. Because literally, this is going to take so long to kill one of these, probably. I mean, and not like hours or anything, so I'm not trying to say that, but, uh, it's definitely going to take one second. Okay, so we're not looking for the the uh, little ones, the punies. We're at least wanting 16th levels. So here's what we're going to do. Pop, consume. Ooh. Ooh. Now let's throw this down on them. We'll start here. Um, so, if we're in the Perseus armor with the plates, this guy is So we'll have to fill out how hard he can actually get it.
watch out, they can, can kill us. Okay, so we're good. I'm gonna heal once so we can heal under him. Before we finish him. Okay, so we just unlocked that. Now we're gonna track it immediately. That was not a bad reward, I thought. Okay, so that's the only one we need to be tracking right now. That mech stuff and shatter bots, we're not doing those right now. So we're gonna have to kill almost a hundred of these guys to uh, get our uh, codex off of it. Single codex, that's, that's pretty extreme. They're big too. Look at this. Oh, well, let's scan one too. I think that's a good idea. See what I mean though? Man, we're not killing them so fast that the loot pill lights. I don't move that. Out right there. Just think that's better? Yeah. Oh, no, not better. Okay. Maybe right here? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, sorry. I'm still working out where good places are for everything on my screen. We're not trying to kill babies. Oh, thank you very much, by the way. I think we got this guy pretty good. It would be nice to see a nice little... Uh, oh. See, that's really good. For like, as big as these are... I think that we're not... I mean, I don't know. I should probably one day learn exactly how much we're burning per shot. I just add that the rest of the time. Ooh, did you see that? He got pretty good. What was that, 80? That was dangerous. Definitely don't. And so, yeah, serpent plates and adjusted pixie is enough to actually. And so, it doesn't take the extreme armor. All of this is repairable. And in all honesty, all of it's actually pretty cheap. I mean, like, the pixie armor or the visory you're going to get on your own. The, if you wanted to go and buy a uh, set of uh, serpent plate, they're actually not that expensive. And it seems to have adjusted this adjusted pixie armor perfectly for this, to be honest. I mean, like, they are getting... Ooh, we do not want two of them. No. So here's what's going to happen here. I'm going to pull out bigger guns. So we're going to heal ourselves once. We're going to arsenic chip this guy. Catch him on fire. That's 500 damage that's going to happen in one minute. He is not going to like that. That's going to help us put him down faster than that guy decides to act on. See? Boom. But we might have more than one, so we're gonna zap that again off. Kill ourselves. See, they are trying to take us down. That happened the other day, Rhino Beetle. He did get close to that. If I didn't have this on, uh, he would have done it. Let's buy him anyway. I don't like to waste it. I'm frying this guy. Boom. Look at that. We just got some mission done somewhere. Uh, that's not what we're working on, but but we did it. And I'm glad about that somehow. I'm sure we get something off of it. Ooh, look at that. That 
rhino beast it really does slap. Okay. Did you ever click your wrong button? Happens to be just, just to say, hey, I for sure sometimes click the wrong button. I really wonder how hard those are to tame. These things are so freaking big. They're impressive. Get one of these done right. So, in all reality, this guy's probably hit pretty hard. I think I'm gonna have to clear out some of these babies. There's a bunch of big ones, so this is part of it. We'll kill this baby. Hit it on the right. Then we'll get these big ones. Look at that wolf coming over ass. Yeah, I probably should incinerate this. Oh, that's are having a pretty kick butt day I feel we're doing pretty good I'm playing a bit I mean I'm playing a bit I hope you guys are doing it as well I consider it definitely not the day Ourselves and take him out. I forgot to see how much my uh, chip was at before we started the play. And so, I don't know what to say about that. That was an accident, for sure. And so, we'll try to be better about that. I almost think I could mine right here and probably do that. Very hard. 
I'm gonna scan the next one. We'll get the staff off the one. I apologize for not doing that earlier. Successfully jam me on that. One. Just gonna say that. Jerk head right here. All these little babies want to swarm me right here. I kept seeing that Carmelon appear. on the bigger ones, but honestly, these little ones just keep on getting away. And they're only a small level difference, but... I feel they want to give us a global today. I mean, I don't know about that. But I'm not sure. If we're gonna just fill things on behalf of ourselves, we might as well fill it out if they want to give us a global. I mean, that's what I would like to say. That thing's so beastie. Those tusks are pretty good. That one is, is junk. That's a junk. Like that's a pierce the car horn. It does look like I'm gonna have to kill some babies, right? That mom is out there, surrounded by a sea of, um, 
you know, we'll kill him. Then it, it really is going to be like, hey, you kind of need to have to kill something other than. What the crap? Hold the Alpha Pamphalons. Okay, how hard does anybody think one of those old Alpha Pamphalons is? I'm wearing the wrong armor, I'm sure. That's why I don't like seeing random things over when I'm like hunting. I have really a hard time to be honest. We'll resist. bunch of big ones after we kill all these little ones, I'm sure. Or at least some of them, not like all of them, but... I wish it was on something that mattered. Where's one of your big old guys? This is kind of seeming ridiculous. I feel that there should be a bigger ones here.
see there's big ones out here. I did not expect him to, what the crap is up with this guy? I'm sorry, that blows me away. Holy crap. Oh no, I don't need to do that. What is up with you? You are a freaking fighter, buddy. Wake up. Yeah, he's definitely trying to kill me. I'm gonna back up a little bit. Looks like we're just gonna keep aggroing a bunch of these. Oh, look at that crap. We'll sell that. Is that full? What's the TT on this? Yeah, I don't even know that. Where's the saucepan? That's freaking almost full. I would leave that, but I don't trust this situation now because the last time I got from, like a ridiculous amount of damage, basically. And so why would you trust it? Okay. Oh, 
was really hoping I'd heal before all of a sudden he just all of a sudden went boom and just put me down. I was actually worried he put me down. Oh, that's good. We needed some wool, I guess, but... Wait, there big ones somewhere? Oh, come on. The little ones. It seems like they almost take us out there. Of course, he jams it. This little one's jamming better than the big ones. I'm glad. The little ones kind of the better one you can hook up on, but it's obnoxious. Holy crap, until he decides he wants to walk across the map. I think I'm about to sneeze. Just to be honest. There's a bunch of these guys, but they're not really in a great position, so I don't know what to think here. This is, this, we've decided it's a mega, a mega one. Give us all the pet in the game. Mega, Bob. I don't know why he's a mega Bob, but. 
Okay, super. We miss healing on those, it's gonna really suck. Honestly. That thing can send us rolling pretty fast. Oh, one's right there. Come around the body and boom, there the body is. It doesn't seem like they want to, really, but I mean, I'm just saying, if they did want to, take it. I'm never sure how loud that is, so I'm kind of trying to move it away. sure what I do with a partial I am remnant but I'm sure it's somehow. When they crouch down, if you took away the horns and stuff, I was gonna say it looks like a frog, but honestly, it probably doesn't really look like that. Like a frog. There are a lot of these. Things. This is an excellent place to. And honestly, if we were way, way stronger, we go and hunt some bigger stuff. If I can gain 10 more levels in um, biotropics and 10 more levels in uh, pyrokinetics, though, we're going to really attempt the mini hack code mission. That just was so freaking brutal. And uh, it's just way expensive. I don't want to retry it without um, without pretty much being confident that we would win, honestly. Because that was so far the hardest incident that I've ever done. And uh, plus, we have to make special arrangements through like Winter Elf to obtain a key, all kinds of other little details. But. It cost a considerable amount of head to just shoot your way through it. Uh, I think uh, there were at least six dragons in there, bunch of zombies, some virus tongs. I mean, it was just freaking insane. And so, I don't want to redo that unless we can actually win. I need this guy to get here or he's going to go run. Oh, thank God. I was watching him thinking... This guy's gonna go get up for a second now. And so, I don't know. Right now, we're focused heavily on getting enough intelligence and finishing up the whole level uh, 40 as a uh, 
projectile launcher engineer, which is way close. Like, we only have half of a percent. Half a percent of that is an uh, actual lot. Like, we're gonna have to do an entire other batch for that half a percent on Monorail, which is freaking nuts. 310 runs every day for a month solid for like the Monterey day to get a half a percent. Because that's where we got the last half a percent. And so, holy crap, isn't that fun, right? It was actually fun. I, I shouldn't be complaining. And it wasn't actually overall that expensive. I mean, uh, most of them were way qualified to do that. It was just every 30 day solid Monterey crafting. That was it was interesting. Got it lot of points though, so. We healed him. Thank you very much, by the way. Okay, so right here, bam. Oh, well, it would have been nice if they said, hey, we're going to give you a global. I don't want these babies. Oh, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Uh, what is going on here? Why aren't we doing stuff? Man. Guys, this is pretty dang good hard. I'm curious. I'm going to scan the next one before we because I would like to actually know their, their points. Definitely not as tough as those spiders, though. Thank you very much for the raid, by the way. Hope you're all also having a great day and ready for Christmas. I'm sure you are all, like, I mean, who isn't at this point? Well not ready ready I actually have to go out and do a little bit more shopping tonight to be honest but I know that's, that's pretty not. but you know when last minute people give you uh oh thank you uh, I'm not ready all the way either you know because last minute gifts people will hook you up with something last minute and you didn't think about it before and then all of a sudden you're like, oh, I guess I do have more gifts to buy. Um, and so that's where I'm at too. I have uh, at least six more gifts to buy, which is blessed. That means like six people that I didn't even know were going to be like randomly getting me stuff. We're like, hey, we thought about you. So I'm not complaining about it, but I definitely have to go out and get them something. Because I don't feel like, yeah, I'm glad you thought about me, but. Cause you know how some years somebody will get you gifts, some years they don't, so it's very hard knowing who you're getting gifts for. I try to just get gifts for everybody that I like, which is But then sometimes... Well, we all know. But, life is good. Well, be able to give us a nice fat Christmas global. That would be a little better, but they don't have it. But we would take it. Ooh, that was a horrible one. See, you talk about a global, and they're like, we're going to give you the worst. I don't know. That's not probably the worst. But that's pretty bad for that big of a creature. Okay. I really like these. I wish you could ride them. I'm just saying, there's a few creatures on Fire that should be mounts. Honestly, though, I would take a mount like H1. 
Those would be pretty good. Cool. Or those armor maxes. An armor max. They look fascinating. Actually, there's two mounts. That's another crappy one. See what I'm saying? Okay. I'm in a positive thought here. And we're just going to hope that there are not going those crappy crappies. Merry Christmas. But we are kicking butt on this little thing though. Ooh. Pretty beast. I like it when the monsters are beast enough that you can kill them and they're a challenge. Honestly, I think in the person sound these guys would have actually been getting through it all. Not a really good hit either. Wow. I'm gonna switch. I will actually do that. Let's do this real quick. Bam. That better? We smidged it down. I had to do that the other day on a different game, too, so it doesn't shock me. The music in uh, D&D is really, really, really loud, I guess. Okay, boom. These guys. Okay, that's a little better. They're all baby. Oh, there. Here's all the parents. We're not trying to get little ones, you know? Okay. I'm really impressed with uh, those apartments they put on. Sorry. Honestly, I don't know when they're going to release those. And I don't have the kind of pet to be like, you know, let me throw down on one of those. But that's not a bad hit either. So I think if we can keep them at five pet, we're good. I think it's down for their like, hey, we're going to give you a pet back. I'm pretty sure we're putting more in a pet and blasty blast into these guys. And so. And by the way, I'm not expecting to recover on this. The only way you can probably recover on this, because I'm not really a hunter, is if we got some kind of HOF or global or something. So, but we are going to get a little further into the codex and uh, kill a bunch of dino beetles. By crafting, I expect recovery though. It drives me nuts. As a hunter, I'm still working. By far. Let's see. That's not horrible either. That's an adult. Come on. Chip and it didn't seem to actually do any actual hit. This will get a bomb. Oh, see, that's a crappy one. Again. Okay, right here. Good thing that coffee finally kicked in. Man, at the beginning of the stream, I was legit tired as crap. This holiday stuff wears you out somehow. 
I, I, I think it's a shopping. Shopping. Some people are shoppers. They get invigorated. Oof. Not me. Okay, here we got a big one. Come on, fire, fire. I need to kind of pay attention here a little bit. This is just an excellent area for hunting these though. And the weaker ones, I've got globals off of the weaker ones, they're not horrible to be honest. Whoa. Oh, that noise freaked me out. I'm gonna just be honest. I thought something was sneaking up on me. I was like, great, what's well, gonna get me? Okay, right here. Is he stuck on something? Are you stuck? Not as hard as that one that sent us flying though. That was kind of ridiculous. Oh my. Oh, well. I think they still want to give us a global. They're just holding out till they end or something. I don't know. Maybe not. Taking about 25 for each one of these, right? I think hits. Maybe not. This one's a little better. Uh, okay, next one. I'm gonna craft a big sword so we can hunt these with a sword too, I think. That'll probably be a good idea. I don't think I'll take too big of a sword, like 35th level or something like that, maybe. Maybe 30th level. I don't think I'm 30th level with these swords, I think I'm 30. But we'll have to this same hunt with swords and get some more of this knocked out. Okay, so I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Uh, I actually do have to go get ready for Christmas. Uh, peace, very best wishes, and I hope you all have a great holiday. Thanks for watching the stream, and stay epic.